Knuckles. Upsetting him and making it out winner's side. Yes, he told me that uh, he lost to him. But, you know, Pac-Man's hard, man. Yeah, so speaking of which, you know, Sinji, great Pac-Man. The greatest Pac-Man in uh, New York City right now. He just made it onto the PR. I believe he's PR. The only Pac-Man. <laughs> yeah, you're right, you're right. The only Pac-Man. You corrected me. But that uh, still makes him the best. Makes he's him the, the only best. one. The only Pac-Man. He's the best Pac-Man still. Uh, <laughs> he just made it onto the top 10 New York City PR that just came out. Yes, so sir. he's definitely been making strides. He's been on the grind. He goes to so many tournaments weekly. I think he goes to three or four tournaments a week. Hey, man, that's the wave. And, you know, if you're making money from it, too, it's definitely something that's uh, possible for you. And I know it catches a lot of people off guard because people aren't used to fighting against Pac-Man. That's because he's the only one that Calvary. exists. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, you don't know how to fight against Pac-Man because only three, like, there's only three people in the in the country that play this character. Exactly. But now... He's one of them, man. You gotta be prepared for it. I wonder if Tweak was like, trying to get some advice for the Pac-Man matchup from someone, or if he's just going completely blind. What? Now this is now I I kind of saw this coming. Sinji sometimes doesn't feel comfortable with the Pac-Man matchup against certain characters. Cloud being one of them. Yeah, that's a fair. He's been yeah. experimenting with Mewtwo. I don't think he should be going Mewtwo this early because he's only I've only seen him go Mewtwo like Let once go. ever against a Cloud. So against like the caliber of Tweak, I don't know if this is gonna make the cut, but we'll see if Sinji will prove me wrong. Yeah, man, I've seen crazier things happen. I know Sinji, uh, you know, he has a Mario. He also has um, a Rosalina as a secondary. I didn't know he was working on a Pac-Man. Excuse me, a Mewtwo. Um, but, you know, we'll see what works out. The Tweak, obviously, uh, doesn't need any introduction. Power rank number three in New Jersey. No, number two in New Jersey. Excuse me. Yeah, Sinji's been talking about how he's been wanting to drop Mario. He doesn't feel comfortable using him anymore. He'll yeah. still have him in his re repertoire, but just not as often. He used to use him for against John Numbers' Wii Fit Trainer in the New York City tournaments. So he's putting up uh, quite a bit of a fight, using the neutral air out of shield in order to rack up a little bit of damage, but now we have a limit break on deck from Tweak. Yeah, I'm not sure how comfortable Tweak is going to be in this matchup either. Um, you know, V2s are very hard to come by. Uh, I don't know how often he even plays uh, Blue, who is South Jersey's uh, resident pack uh, Mewtwo player. So him to come to New York City. We got like five Mewtwo's. Yeah, for real. You see, Sinji trying to opt for a pivot grab there, trying to catch the landing of Tweak, but Tweak ended up just spacing it just right. Got the hit. Ooh, there's a pivot grab he's been looking for. He can charge up his little bit Ooh. of aura ball here. We see he's definitely holding on to that limit break for just the right moment. And this could possibly be it. We have a possible edge guard opportunity from Tweak. There you go, Tweak just turtling and shield. I uh, know there's really not much Sinji can do if he's uh, recovering. Good falling up air off the platform. Gonna put Sinji in a unfavorable position. The the beauty of uh, the air dodge from Mewtwo is that he's able to just go all over the place. You don't know exactly which direction he might go. So he has a, he has a pretty deceiving air dodge. As well as it might go, it might, maybe he's doing an up B. You don't know. Oh, Catches nice. him with an up smash. And that'll as do it. it. Takes the kill. Sinji taking first blood with his Mewtwo. You know, I was waiting for the up smash to come out. Are you serious, um, Sinji? No, you cannot do this. This is, this is exactly what I was talking about. Sinji's Mewtwo is not exactly up to snuff yet. Like he hasn't, he's barely used him in a tournament setting, and that's kind of showing it. Yeah, I mean, hey, no better time than the present to you know give these things a, a try. I guess so. Maybe he just wanted a one stock match. Wow. Tweak putting on so much pressure right now. You know, Sinji giving him an inch, and uh, Tweak gonna try to run away with it. So Tweak falling down with these up airs and neutral airs to another up air. He wants another combo. Sinji, Sinji's struggling. Once oh. again, another SD coming from Sinji. You know, it's like you put the Mewtwo in the oven to see if it's like ready and you just yeah. not, you didn't make it and, enough. And, and you come out and you're... you're and, and it's you're, raw turkey and you didn't cook it enough and now you have... Now you gotta order Wendy's for Thanksgiving yeah, now you order, and the whole family hates you. Yeah. That's kind of what Sinji's going through, unfortunately. Let's see if he's gonna go for a character swap or if he's gonna stick with Mewtwo. I'm sure the fans at home want to see his Pac-Man. I mean, I'm sure they do, but you know... It's up to Sinji if he feels comfortable enough going. Because like you said, this is the winner's bracket. So, uh, you know, he has some wiggle room. Uh, you know, we'll see. We'll see. Is, it, his Mewtwo didn't look bad. But it no, it's not. It's just he didn't. I, he just kept flubbing the recoveries. Maybe it's like the introduction of like being on stream, having a whole bunch of people around him. This is his first time on stream at Guitar. <laughs> Intro to Mewtwo. Yeah. <laughs> Mewtwo 100. <laughs> Mewtwo 101. Do you have to buy the textbook for that class? Oh, yeah. It's called... Number one, I don't know. Oh, fiddlesticks. Going to the trip to Smashville. They're both going to charge. Sinji decides, you know what, it's better that he doesn't have Limit Break than I do have the Shadow Ball. All right, there we go. Good start here from Sinji. Making good use out of Nair. God, 
Let me just talk about how good like regular cross slash is for a second. It's really good in the neutral when you're just trying to like punish a spot dodge or a roll. It does 19 damage, dude. It's not as F smash yeah. like charge does 14. Like it if you had every single swing of it, it's just so good. I mean, it is possible to SDI it out of it if you if you get caught at a certain angle. Nice. Denji catching that down tilt into up smash conversion, looking a little slick. There you go. Gets the nair falling on the platform. Not going to get much of a follow up out of it. The beauty about Mewtwo is even if you can't reach someone, you're at least, at worst, getting stage positioning back. So you said you're trying to go for the up smash. The tweak definitely baiting it out. The downside of that up smash is if you throw it out there, it's got has a lot of cooldowns here. It's easy to punish it. Oh, wow. Whoa, whoa, what? What? Man, Tweak ain't getting a Christmas gift this year. That was kind of that was kind of nutty. A bag of coal for him, man. He just got like he just got slightly tapped and just fell to his death. This was uh, most awkward yeah. hitbox. He, he must now he, he jumps too. He must use a dark type move or something. But again, let's hope that doesn't uh, demoralize Sinji. Oh, oh, as you say that though, mind. as you say that, wow, Sinji. <laughs> I just saw Anti pop up, pop up in a bracket. It looks like he wants some money from somebody. Well, Tweak's going to take that 2-0 over Sinji. Very uh, nice stuff from uh, from Tweak. Yeah, he didn't let the Mewtwo fluster him. That